beloved principal, to our academic coordinators, to our ever supportive teachers and staffs, and to our family, most especially our parents, friends, fellow classmates, and students. Ladies and gentlemen, a blessed day to everyone. Grade school life, an unforgettable memory in every student's life. Before I entered this school, I was so clueless, nervous, and ecstatic, all at the same time. Some people before even doubted if I can cope up with the rest of the incoming grade one as I was a transfer youth and very introverted back then and some find me weird. All I ever knew was this is a Catholic school. Nothing more, nothing less. I'm doubting of entering here at first, but in the end, I ended up here. And what a great experience it was for me. And now, it has been a long six years, but here we are, ready to graduate. We worked hard to get to this point. But we didn't do it by ourselves, especially during this time of pandemic. We owe all of this to the ever understanding, considerate, and caring people. To our teachers, thank you for sharing your time, talent, and knowledge with us. You took the extra time and effort to explain and repeat the tasks and assignments to us. Even sometimes we'd like you to repeat it because either we don't understand it or we weren't paying attention or due to technical difficulties brought upon by online schooling. You put some extra efforts to make your lessons more interesting just to lighten our mood, and so we won't get sleepy or bored with this kind of online schooling setup that we have. Thank you for being our second parent in this school. You gave us some advices when we have problems. You set us and challenged us to live up our dreams. With this, we are thankful and grateful. To our principal and all of staff, Thank you for keeping things running smoothly as adapting to this new normal of schooling is no joke and we're thankful and grateful that you pulled this off. There are more rooms for improvement but this is a great start. Thank you for making the school and your students good as possible. You made yourself busy and took the extra miles just to make and run the school perfectly during the pandemic. With that, we salute you. To our guidance counselors, Thank you for listening and trying to keep us on the right track. You teach us the do's and don'ts in our school that we can also apply in our daily lives. You try to make us a better individual when we do something bad. Without your help, some of us might not be standing and sitting right now in our graduation ceremony. To the staff, thank you for keeping our school safe, clean, and orderly. You know how better than anyone else on what reasons we've been doing during our breaks. And lastly, to our parents. Thank you for giving us the chance to study in this respected school. We know that you worked hard just to support our needs. Not only that you have provided us with what we needed at school, you also took extra time, patience, and effort to teach us much more advanced lessons that we needed to work on, and constantly reminding us to submit our, our to-dos on time and much earlier. Admit it. We also learn to get tech savvy with those video editing skills that becomes very handy. With this, we are eternally thankful and grateful. Thank you for everything and you deserve a round of applause, more than us. As we can see, behind each graduate, there must have been a lot of people providing support just to come up here. The best way to our gratitude is to make the most of the opportunity we've been given and being ready for our future. Again, to those who have made a difference in our lives, we owe an infinite gratitude to you. I just want to leave you simple words. Thank you, and may God bless all of us.